up guys it's your girl that's so jasmine back with another video so today i'll be doing a cook with me and i will be making salmon and spinach it's a very nutritious and healthy meal so we're gonna get right into the video so here's the salmon usually a long slab but we um we usually cut them in strips because it's better for us so my first seasoning is mrs dash it has no salt at all no sodium so it's really good to use when you're trying to make a healthy meal with little to no salt so you're gonna sprinkle not too much and I like to do it on the back also and a little bit on the sides The next seasoning is Himalayan salt. You can use any salt that you want. You can use sea salt or you can use any salt that you would like. The next seasoning is garlic. This also has no sodium in it. And if you want your seasoning to have a little spice and a little brown in it, you can also use blackened seasoning. Now that I'm done seasoning my salmon, I'm gonna put the stove on medium and let it heat up for about five minutes. You wanna make sure you use some non-stick cooking spray. I use olive oil, but you can use Pam or any other non-stick cooking spray that you prefer. So we're gonna shake it and spray it. Okay, so now that our pan is starting to heat up, we're gonna add some olive oil. I'm not gonna put too much. A little oil goes a long way, guys, so you don't have to put too much oil. Make sure it gets all over the pan, like that. And we're gonna use tongues to make sure you don't scratch or put any marks on your pan. So now it is hot, and we're gonna get our salmon. I'm gonna take it and place it. It doesn't take long to make salmon. You wanna make sure it's cooked all the way through. So it is brown enough for you to turn it over. So we're gonna turn it. And guys, you wanna turn it on the side to get the size also. And it's okay if it breaks off, it happens.
And now we're going to turn it over on the other side. You can always go back in and let it get it brown some more. So this is how it's looking. So now we're going to clean this out because we're going to use it to make a garlic butter paste for the salmon. So guys, we're going to put it um, not on high, but a little bit close to high. We want to make sure it gets hot. You're going to need some butter for this, whichever butter that you use. We're going to get some about this much since we have two salmons, maybe a little bit more. garlic paste and we're going to stir it up until it is mixed all together and when it's mixed together when it starts looking like this that means it's pretty much done we're going to turn this off and we want to get the paste scrape it all down Y'all, this is like the perfect paste to use when you're making salmon. But this is how it's looking right now. And right now we're going to go ahead and make our spinach. So you're going to turn your stove on. On medium or high. Either one is fine. So we have our baby spinach. It is organic. You don't have the organic spinach, but if you want to, that's fine. So now we're going to make that same exact paste. And we're going to put that in the pan. You're not going to need much of this, just a little, and a little bit of the paste. And like before, you're going to stir it up, stir it up, stir it up. Completely. Now we're gonna get our spinach and drop it in there. And we're gonna add a little Himalayan salt or any salt of your choice. And now you're gonna turn your stove off because now it is done. And now that everything is done, we're gonna start plating. And guys, this is the final product. So, it's a very healthy meal. So if you guys want more videos like this, just comment below and I'll give you a lot more videos like this. A lot of cook with me's and everything, a lot more. Um, healthy meals and meals I eat on the regular so this is the end of the video make sure you like comment share and subscribe and follow me on Instagram at that's so Jasmine and I'll see you guys in my next video